Week 14, we are doing Experiment 88 in our Van Cleave book. It's called Tug of War. You will need one sheet or 12 inches, one foot of tin foil. You will need a half a cup of tap water. You will need about five drops of blue dye. You will also need that rubbing alcohol again. You also need an eyedropper if your rubbing alcohol does not have the dropper feature or the little spout feature. Mine does, so I don't need the eyedropper. Okay, so what you need to do is take your water that's in the cup, put your drops of dye in there so it's nice and dark and blue. You're not gonna use a whole half a cup on this foil sheet or otherwise it'll just go everywhere. And it says, and it says right here that the thinner layer, the thinner the layer, the better. So we wanna put a nice thin layer. So what we're gonna do is we are going to pour a thin layer it said to smooth it out, and I tried to smooth it somewhat, but it's supposed to pulsate, like it's supposed to pulsate or gyrate or whatever on this foil. And so I kind of want to hear that if it's supposed to do that. Now this isn't looking super thin, but I'm trying to make it as thin as possible. Hopefully this will not be another failed experiment. All right, we did that. So after we do that, pour a very thin layer, we did that. Add a drop of alcohol to the center of the thin layer of colored water. All right, so I'm gonna take my alcohol, I'm gonna put it in the middle, and let's, what's supposed to happen is the blue water is supposed to go to the outside. It acts kind of like a magnet, where you know, like two negatives don't connect, so it separates, and that's kind of what's happening here. The water and the alcohol are supposed to spread apart. Uh, the water is supposed to rush away from the alcohol and it's supposed to leave a very thin layer of alcohol on the foil and as the water pulls away there's supposed to be a pulsation around the edge of the alcohol let's see if that happens you ready i'm going to pan over it here we go we're going to drop it right in the middle mm. Ooh, it's doing it see that see how it's pulsating right there can you get that look at that that's pretty cool and what happened what's happening right now is um when the drop of alcohol touches the water, the two liquids separate immediately, which it did. Alcohol is pulling away from the water and the water is pulling away from the alcohol. Can you, can you get it? Pulling away from the alcohol. The water molecules seem to, the water molecule, molecules seem to be victorious and the water separates outward, taking some of the alcohol with it. Now the reason, oh, it's still doing it because it's still fighting. It's gonna, it's still gonna do the, so can, you, can you get that? It's still gonna do the little vibrations until the alcohol has fully mixed with the water. Right now it's still pulling against each other, you know, like fighting with each other. Uh, that's that's what that is. The bridge has a pulsating motion because the water and the alcohol molecules continue to pull at each other. The pulling stops when the two liquid, liquids totally mix together. Very cool. This one's still going for it. They're still, they're still not totally mixed. This one worked. This was a good one. All right. Awesome.